Hi friends, welcome to my another video. Today in this video, I will discuss about CT button. What is current transformer button? This video is one of the video in my current transformer series. As in my previous video, I explained about the CT ratio or the current transformation ratio, which is one of the detail available in the current transformer nameplate. In this video, we will focus on the other detail present in the current transformer nameplate, which is CT button. In the current transformer nameplate, you will find some VA value. For example, in this CT, the VA value is given as 5 slash 3.75. In this current transformer, the VA value is given as 15. And in other CT, for example, this CT has given the VA value as 15. So what is this VA value and what is represent in the current transformer and what is the significance of this VA we will learn in this video. This VA value in the CT nameplate is nothing but the CT button, current transformer button. CT button in simple language means the total connected load across the secondary winding of current transformer. What does it mean? Suppose we have one CT, okay, we have one CT, this CT has secondary windings fine this terminal name is s1 and s2 in order to measure the current of this conductor we place the ct in such a manner that this conductor is passing through the window of this current transformer in order to measure the current of this conductor we place we connected one ammeter across the secondary winding of the ct in this case this ammeter is the ct button why because this ammeter will have its own resistance so whatever load is connected across the secondary winding of the current transformer is called CT button. Here the ammeter is connected with the secondary winding of the current transformer. Then we can say this ammeter is the CT button for this current transformer. For example, if we connected one KWH meter in series with the ammeter and it is connected with the same CT, then this ammeter plus KWH meter is called CT button for this current transformer. Suppose this ammeter and KWH meter is not connected very near to the current transformer and it is connected very far from the current transformer. Then the button on this current transformer or the button on the CT is due to this ammeter, due to this KWH meter and due to the resistance of the wire which is connecting this ammeter and KWH meter through the secondary winding of the CT. So hope you clearly understood what is CT button. CT button is nothing but the total load connected to the secondary winding of the CT. But here one question arises: what is the importance of this one? Why we are learning CT button? In order to understand what is the significance of this CT button, let me ask one question. How we will come to know that how many metering or protecting device we can connect with the CT? This we will know by the CT button. Suppose if we don't have any information related to CT button and if we connect a meter, KWH meter, multifunction meter with the same CT, then the button on the CT will be more, then this CT will not give the accurate reading to the ammeter, to the KWH meter and it will not give the correct signal to the relays and other things. So how we will know how many measuring or protecting instrument we can connect with the one CT this information we will get it by the CT button to better understand this concept let's, let us take an example suppose here the ammeter has a resistance of 2 ohm okay and this CT has a ratio of 300 by 1 so how much current is flowing in the secondary winding if there is a 300 ampere current in the primary winding it will be 1 ampere so what would, would be the voltage across this resistance that is V is equal to IR I is 1 ampere R is 2 ohm so it will be 1 into 2 that is 2 volt so the voltage across this ammeter is 2 volt now let us check the power across this ammeter what is that power power will be V into I so what is V voltage across this ammeter is 2 volt so 2 and the current through this ammeter is 1 ampere so what is the VA across this power across this ammeter is 2 VA right suppose if we connect this ammeter with the current transformer which have the VA value 1 VA 
then this ammeter will not be suitable for that current transformer. Why? Because the ammeter which you connected with this CT has the total VA 2 VA but the CT has the rated VA as 1 VA which is more than the CT rated VA that is the CT rated button. So we cannot choose this ammeter for that CT. So hope you understand what is the significance and the importance of CT button. If someone will ask you how many measuring, measuring instrument or the protecting, protective instrument we can place across the CT then your question will be to that guy is what is the CT button for that current transformer. The CT button rating as per the IEC standard International Electrotechnical Commission standard are 1.5 VA, 3 VA, 5 VA, 10 VA, 15 VA, 20 VA, 30 VA, 45 VA and 60 VA. What does it mean? As I explained you, it means if suppose if some CT has the VA CT button as 60 VA, it means we can connect a load across that CT till 60 VA. If some CT has the CT VA as 1.5, then we can connect the load that can be a meter, KWH meter, multifunction meter or any protective devices. Then that load have the VA value should not be more than 1.5 VA. Why? Because the CT which you connected with the load has less than 5 VA button rating. In that case, Either you have to select the load in such a way that the VA value of the load is less than 1.5 VA or you have to choose the CT which have the higher VA rating. Hope you clearly understand. Let us calculate the CT button of a current transformer with the CT ratio 200 slash 5 and connected with an ammeter having the resistance value 0.5. So we need to design, we need to calculate the CT button. So what we will do? This is the CT S1 and S2 terminal and there is one ammeter connected across this CT okay and this ammeter has a resistance of 0.5 ampere. So how many current will maximum current will flow through the CT in the secondary winding that is 5 ampere. So what would be the voltage across this ammeter? This will be simple Ohm's law V is equal to IR. I here is 5 ampere and the resistance across this uh, resistance of this ammeter is 0 0.5 ohm so what would be the value 2.5 volt which i wrote it here 2.5 volt now we have to check the power across this ammeter so v into i simple so what would be the value v is voltage is 2.5 volt into current is flowing through this ammeter is 5 ampere so what would be the value is equal to 7.5 VA so if we want to connect an ammeter which having a resistance of 0 0.5 ohm then we have to choose a CT which have the button rating more than 7.5 VA so which one we have to choose a CT which have the button CT button 10 VA hope you clearly understand what is CT button how to calculate CT button here some standard value of VA is given for a metering and protecting devices which is generally connected with the CT. For analog meter it is 1 VA, for digital meter it is 0.5 VA, for current coil and watt meter VAR meter it is 1.5 VA, for current coil and of energy meter 2 VA, current coil of power factor meter 2.5 VA, current coil of tri vector meter it is 5 VA. In same way for different types of relay the VA value is given like for the earth fault relay for the unrestricted earth fault relay motor protection relay and uh, IDMT earth fault relay the different VA value is given for such type of load which can be connected with the protective type CT. As I told in my discussion that if any measuring device or a protective relay is very far from the current transformer then we have to consider the resistance of the wire which is connecting the CT and the protective relay or the metering device during calculating the CT button. We will discuss the practical case of the CT button when I will make video on the selection of current transformer. I hope you clearly understand what is CT button, what is the significance of CT button and how to calculate the CT button. If you find my video something informative and you learn something new from my video then please subscribe to my channel and like to this video. Okay, I will make more videos on the current transformer so stay tuned.
we will meet in any other video till then take care keep learning and bye bye thank you so much